Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 54, round of 16 match between Kill Bill, Volume 2, and Augmented Beard. Um, Beard has a pretty nice high elf team here, a bunch of guard, uh, bludge and everything, really nice. Uh, however, Kill Bill downloads a TV, has a wizard, has griff, and is absolutely going to dice the pants off. <laughs> no. But he does have a mighty blow tackle and a tackle jump up tackle problem, so like... That's the best possible thing versus elves, right? Jump up tackle pond is incredible. The elves need to foul him and hope they uh, hope they roll well, basically. P Diddy probably should have an offset LOS. But didn't. Mmm. Are all money matches now, thanks to DLA Piper, glorious. Instant armor break. <laughs> Panningham doesn't make a removal. Um, Kill Bill will be wondering if his game is bugged out or not. Underwhelming first turn. There isn't a lot to this human team, is there? But Griff's really nice. And, uh, you know, tackle probably tackle me. But the elves should have enough in their arsenal. The shit thing is, like, you do want to, like, you know, stick somebody on him so he can't hit somebody good, but then it just it's just giving away an extra block, isn't it? It really sucks. Really the fuck. Yeah, I, th I thought I thanked him nine months, but um, maybe that was me. Beaver pregnancies. <laughs> yeah, this is the thing, right? Just giving away this hit, it's like. And it, it puts him in a really exposed spot to pile on as well. So, like, I do like giving it up, it just sucks. It makes it tough, so. Maybe you should have, like, stuck the rest on him if that was possible. And then, like, the rookie would have been there to foul. <laughs> And then, like, you know, giving him the jump up hit on the rest of us, you got a bit of protection, like, taking the. Uh... Oh, there's a rookie here to foul, so yeah. Three assist foul, maybe it's a four assist foul. Maybe a five assist foul. I mean, that's what needs to happen here. Completely sell out this turn to, uh,. Get like a three assist foul. Oof. Oof. to have to expose, isn't it? Fuck me. Oh. Oh, 
This really sucks putting this guy in here. Not sure. Oh, the stun. The stun saves him. Glorious. Brilliant play to put that <laughs> to put that guy in. Wrestle, wrestle is the best kill skill. It's so weird. Oh, nice. Nice little chain. It doesn't really achieve anything, but you know. If you, uh, if you play... At uh, North American time zones, you will be also be able to spot great players like that. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't. I can't help myself. <laughs> Interesting blitz, not what I would have done. I mean, does it prevent assist? He could have put a player in here and, and blitzed him and uh, got more assists on, but he just chose not to. He just chose to focus elsewhere. Wait, and then fouled the wrong player? Okay, well. I think that was a shit turn from Beard. Shit turn. You've got you've got one focus this turn and it's to foul this guy. Like this half is you have to set up gang fouls on this chap. <laughs> and if the humans expose the ball, good. I'm probably not gonna expose the ball for free, but you never know. North American players have been known to randomly expose the ball. Look, look what happens when you don't foul this guy. He just jumps up and cases someone. Like, you weren't guard locking or anything, that's the problem, right? Like, you're just standing guys in front of him. He's just going to jump up and smash them. I mean, this is a good turn back, to be fair. Multiple hits. And, you know, a gang foul if there was anybody left to foul him. <laughs> If there was anybody left to foul him. No, there is more or less. Oof. I had to push here, right? So that this, if this was a push. Because this is two less assists if this is a... Okay, okay, yeah, that's, that's okay. Oh, but he pushed him into stand firm. It's dead. Oh, no, what a mistake. What a mistake at a maker. Could have had two more assists. Doesn't matter. Get some KO'd. But still, this guy should be pushed back to there. <laughs> God. <laughs> Unfortunately, um, Kill Bill is being Kill Bill. So... Getting rid of the claw palm. Not so. Um, not such a big deal.
Things are happening apparently. So eight versus nine. Not terrible, is it? Or ten. Is it ten? No, ten. Eight versus ten isn't terrible. It's set up well to react, but yeah, maybe the turn counter is such that. I don't know, like, even if you move these two somewhere else and, and just switch, I mean, humans are fast. This is pretty hard to defend. Wow, glorious meat cube. Glorious meat cubing. The else can still like kind of take it slow, right? And uh, if they get a two turn back, wait, he's got six players now. Scores with six players. I mean, maybe the strength four can do something, but we've already got perfect formation here with guard. Oh, what? I really like Griff here and the guards on the full line. Is this formation going to be better or just get more hits? I feel like it just might make more hits, which, you know, can end up winning the game, can't it? There's a lot to be said for banging. Yeah, and this is a really good play at the time. Yeah. Yeah, that's a really good play at bang. And get the pylon as well. Oh, doesn't get the pylon, of course. No, I'm just I totally knew that. Uh, it's a bit less. It's a bit less good, right, without piling on. I think with piling on, it's definitely worth it. Without piling on, it's got to be, got to get lucky to pay off. But I wouldn't know about that because I'm never lucky. But you know, maybe if I was uh, kill bill, I'd think this is completely reasonable. I'll probably kill this guy. <laughs> yeah, in the no in the North American time zone, you know, you know you're gonna have to face Mr. Page and Zagini and uh, Kill Bill. You know, bang a central, isn't it? You've got to. Uh... It's bang or be bang. Run bad. Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> well, there you go. Easy drive for the humans. <laughs> Good old Griff. Didn't really use his skill set, but the fact that he was strong in that did. You know, dissuade shots of the ball that maybe would have been taken if it had been a human uh, catcher with the ball. Four players down, but not great ones. Nine players, maybe 10% now. So it's not terrible for the. Not terrible. 
but I also not great. One turn is really rough with just a sidestep. Yes, dog to the dog. Much like the North American time zone, a lot of banging, but not high quality. <laughs> Obviously, instant reroll there. Wrestle kill skill, bound to get a Kaz. <laughs> Sorry, yes, returning champion, dog to the dog, um, <laughs> expert one turner, <laughs> but two of his names. Pretty shocking. Well, he probably thinks he's fucked. I, I, I forgive a lot of fouls because if people think they've lost, then fouling can try. Fouling's a really good way to get lucky, isn't it? And turn the tide of a match. So if you feel you need to get lucky and turn the tide of a match, then. You know, better to foul before it's unwinnable than in a few turns later being like, oh, I've lost my game. Yeah, really hard on my turn. Shocking would be a polite way to describe your one turn. <laughs> Banter! <laughs> This is uh, rubbish having to move players around to make hits on the other. My condolences. I wonder if making that 3D was worth it, eh? Needed one more assist. Maybe. Like, obviously, the position is better having not, but is it that much better that it was not worth doing it? Who knows? Should he have dackered? Probably. If there's one thing Dog to the Dog's gonna do, it's bang on your men. Are oh, we gonna run around with this guy to get an extra hit? No. Gonna hit the catcher. Maybe. Yeah, 3D. No, it's not 3D. It's 3D. Pretend 3D. Mm. I quite like hitting him in, then you get a hit with the thrower if, if, it's, if it's just a 
So does this a large stud? <laughs> right? So does getting all of your players based and get the shit kicked out of them? Like... Okay, well, if you're gonna get lucky then it's pretty good. But like, this is, this is not exactly like good times either, is it? Do you know what I mean? Like, Your offensive drive is gonna suck, however you do it. That's the oh well one D. Like that's the thing, right? Like offensive drives. That's why the Rat Dacker is pretty good, even though it's pretty shit. Because a normal Rat Drive is pretty shit. So while they're not fantastically suited to the Dacker, works works out fine. Look at this minimal banging from Dog to the Dog. Choosing not to block with this guy. Outrageous. Not maximum banging. What? He didn't learn this in the North American time zone. <laughs> Unless he's been watching Nick, I guess. Probably so. Probably does watch Nick, so he doesn't have to play the one company coach. <laughs> oh, fails the jump up. Been a bit of a rubbish turn here. Until that. Chooses not the three D the the diving tackle. I probably would have wanted to. It does suck that they're on the armor eight, doesn't it? On purple uh, two, it'd be really nice to get smash the juicy armor seven. the right strat, right? It's the right thing to do. This guy, this guy fucking owns the elves. He, f he fucking owns the elves, this guy. So, yep. Yeah. Good, good foul. Ah, didn't need diving tackle, just double wand it. Oh, Bolt comes in on the strength four. This is a rowdy wizard. Very rowdy wizard. Super rowdy. Real rowdy. Poor. <laughs> a bit rowdy. Fucking one D. Fucking one D. I, mean, I hate the one D. I mean, I know you've got him, but like, dude, just fucking assist. Got strip. Okay, well, yeah, one D's not so bad then, is it? One day's not so bad with strip, fair enough. Fur enough. Yeah, but it's one day with strip. Yeah. And the game's slipping away, isn't it? Well, the drive's slipping away. I don't know, better to waste than not waste. At the end of the day. Oof, a blockless block. A blockless block. Oh man, if he one turns to win, that's going to be amazing. That's going to be literally so amazing if he one turns to win, isn't it? Oh. I just, want to, I just want to skip. I just want to skip the turn sixteen now. <laughs> I mean, might stop the score. You never know. 
The elves only got one reroll. Might have to score now. I mean, really, might have to score now. I wonder if the play was to like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then hand off to her. Or pass to him. I really hate school. <laughs> I really hate school. <laughs> You can't, you can't give humans a short run. You can give them a one turn. <laughs> you can leave him a one turn, but you can't, you can't leave him three turns. Four turns even. <laughs> no, I think you're going to stall out the half there. So. Yeah, the Dr. Dog said last turn you needed to. Uh, Give himself a better chance. Got to stall the half out right then, that's the biggest thing. Especially with the whiz being gone. Perfect. Maybe he should have just not moved up at all that turn, right? Rather than had two more elves back to cage, he could have just had them back to cage, right? Rather than the field, maybe he didn't need to break up that much, right? With the wizard gone. He could just walk away from the stripper who schooled himself. And yeah, exactly right, Rob. Well, he made himself score easily. I mean, that, that, he made himself score early. I mean, that was. That's all on augmented beard, really. There, that that turn following the wizard was, was terrible, <laughs> terrible. Uh, and I guess it's like kind of you know, and I say terrible, contextually terrible. I don't mean it's like um, terrible compared to someone who's just bought with ball three and learned to play against the AI. But you know what I mean. Contextually terrible. Um, he had four times to score. The wizard's gone, which is huge, right? There's no threat of wizard on the um, The strip board is down, miles away. You can just just run away. And, like you have to stall out the ground. That's the thing. Like humans are so fast. But they've just got they've got two good chances to win it with four turns to score. And even two turns to score, they've got. They've got decent odds, right? With one turn to score and Kill Bill as the coach, they've got no chance of scoring. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't resist, okay? <laughs> I just can't resist. I'm so sorry. <laughs> and hello to the. But yeah, it's just too it's just too easy for the humans to score quick. <laughs> mm. Well may maybe dog to the dog, that's because the truth hurts. <laughs> you can you can you can you can rationalise one one bad play, but <laughs> that all of your games are built upon <laughs> playing in the absolute worst, easiest time zone. Uh... <laughs> 
I'm going to foul the claw, the claw pommer, the tackle pommer again, looks like it. That leaves a gaping hole in the defence though, so this is... Not going for it. Oh! Yeah, and then he puts the side stepper in there, but then that leaves the sideline a bit weak. If he can get the pal. Interesting. Going for the old switcheroo. No AV. Oh no, just get the AV free. Really helps that be right. Yeah, that that foul was a bit shit. <laughs> yeah, I, I always say like oh, I, when I'm playing myself I'm like, oh I hate that foul and it's like, well actually I love it because it's it's bad. <laughs> People. Particularly this one though, I think this one opens up a lot. Right? Blood Stepper being out here on, on a two is oh, it's so powerful. So. This heavy brick is huge, particularly. Now, Augmented Beard has to spread himself super thin. Yeah, exactly, yeah. That, was, that foul was maybe a step too far. It's, it's a bit like, you know, always pile on except when you shouldn't, right? It's like, fouling that guy was really powerful most turns of the game, but maybe this is the one turn where you know, you've, only got, you've only got a couple of turns to break through. This guy's defenseless. Almost certainly the target, and you can see how just just how impactful this island break is. Oh! I guess it's funny because when the blitz happened, I was like, "It will be ring on time." But it's just that was critical island break. Even with you can argue the uh, foul being in the stake or misposition. Looking really rough. I mean, we've got the leap, but uh, also have guard in the squares you can hit from. I mean, yeah, obviously, you know, he played annoying as a stun, but still, if it hadn't been, it would have still been so much harder. So much harder. Oh, down tackle on him as well. So I'm not even going for the leap, and I don't know what the hell he's going for now. <laughs> I guess he's got the one turn. Wait, no, it's turn 16. No, it's just losing. Well, I don't like just choosing to lose. I really don't like the choosing to lose <laughs> play. <laughs> this a mistake? Let's have a look. Three, four, five, six, seven. I believe it might have been 
Griff gets it done. What a legend. Yeah, well played the ball. There's just a few things, right? I liked I like Bear's plan of you know gone off the tackle but uh, the drop of tackle from is just a beast, right? He just wins the game by himself a decent chunk of the time, so I, I like that you target him relentlessly. I really like the foul on Griff. And uh I didn't like setting up Griff to stop the one turn, honestly. Move, movement 8, sidestep, edge 4, I would have uh, I had to just put a shitter on the LOS, to be honest. Um, so there you go, yeah, real American. Uh, congratulations, Kill Bill, commiserations, old men at beard. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.